Breaking news tonight, a Madison businesswoman is making history according to multiple community leaders as the first Latina to open a medical spa in Dane County. NBC 15's Cameron Kelly joins us in the studio. Lolly Rodriguez opened her medical spa just a few days ago. That's right, Michelle, and I first brought Lolly's story almost a year ago to you all when she started her business Vita Aesthetics in the back of a salon in Oregon. With the help of the community and some resources, she opened her own location in Verona. A lot of the resources that helped me will also help other people uh, like me or, you know, that have other business ideas. For the last seven months, Lolly Rodriguez has watered her vision and watched it blossom into a business plan. The Vita Aesthetics owner sought and received help from organizations in Dane County to make her dreams come true. They've helped me, um, you know, get a business plan together. Um, they helped me with funding. Um, and so the support of the community and the support of the clients has helped us grow and um, help us get to where we are today. The blueprint of her journey was crafted at the Latino Chamber of Commerce of Dane County. Then at the Hmong Chamber, she received more opportunities for grants. Almost like when you go to the doctor, right? You come to us, we say, okay, we'll do an assessment. What is it that you need? What's your idea? And then we'll help you to formulate it. The chamber supports entrepreneurs of color through mentorship. It's not only, okay, I have a business now. It's also, okay, let's make sure that that business is, is growing, that the person is growing, that the business is scaling, and it's really about the individual and the community. With Lolly planting a seed in the city of Verona, the mayor says he hopes her journey will encourage others. I think it's just great that, you know, we've worked really hard at the city level to be to be fair and to be open to businesses and just to see it kind of paying off when a business locates here. I think it's, I don't know, it makes me feel good. What began as a business of one has branched off into a team of five. <laughs> I really haven't stopped to think about how far I've come, um, but, you know, as I think about it, I really do feel, you know, humbled and so grateful for all the opportunities um, and all the roads that have led to where I'm at now. And a few other places Lolly received resources from include the Wisconsin Economic Development Corp Corporation, SCORE, and Small Business